Good morning, Nova Scotia. It is Friday, March. No idea. 19th? 20th. 20th today. And we are bringing you an update from up here at Getaway Farm, where it all starts. Um, we just wanted to connect with everybody in the city and let you know that we are launching our online store today. So we are hoping that everybody will transition to buying online. Uh, at this point in time, we're doing pickups at the Seaport Market as well as home delivery. Uh, in the next coming weeks, we will be adding multiple pickup locations around the city. So you can meet us there, we'll load it into your car, you don't have to get out, the payment will be handled all ahead of time. Or we can just bring it right to your house for a little extra money, of course, to make sure that we're covering it. They say hi. Yeah, mm. everyone thinks they moo. They don't moo, they honk. Mm. Uh, so, the store is online now, getawayfarm.ca. You can find it there. Um, you will see increasing numbers of products as the days go by. We are trying to partner with as many local producers as possible so that you can be sure to get all your good, healthy, local vegetables and, uh, well, basically everything, as much as we can find. Of course, we're gonna have all your protein needs covered with all our local, sustainable, and humane products. Um, but this guy here, this is Thomas, he's my brother. Uh, he runs the farm side of things and I run the shop side of things. So I wanted Tom here to tell you a little bit about how this is affecting us up here at the farm so that you understand kind of what this all takes to ensure a secure food supply through this crazy, crazy time. So Tom, what is our biggest concern up here? Uh, well, we're really concerned about uh, being able to supply everybody with uh, the beef they want. And so we're quarantining ourselves, self-isolating as much as possible so as to make sure we don't get sick so we can continue to supply you guys with all the meat that you need right. and deserve. And uh, we're just hoping that you all stay safe during this time. That's awesome. Yeah, so food security is a big thing right now. As you've all seen, the grocery stores are struggling to keep up. And uh, we have a lot of producers in this province that are potentially going to be massively impacted by this and so we're hoping that we can all work together and make sure that you still have the opportunity to support Nova Scotian agriculture, help rebuild rural Nova Scotia and maintain a secure food supply in the province through this. So you may not see a whole lot of Thomas and I as we uh, work up here and try and keep everything going. I'm just providing my help to Tom while trying to provide help to the team in the city. Uh, and if you see anybody in the city that's working in the shop or handing you your order or delivering to your house, thank them because they are taking some risks to make sure that everybody is able to get the food that they need. Uh, it has been clearly communicated to me that everybody within the team wants to make sure that you guys can still get your food. So as much as we need to be maintaining a safe environment for both the staff and for you, it's our utmost goal to make sure that we do that in a safe way possible be as safe as we can but make sure that you're still getting your food so the store is live go check it out we are going to be altering our hydrostone hours trying to reduce them down a bit so trying to kind of minimize the risk of exposure for our clientele and for our staff so over the next few days you're going to see hydrostone start to tighten up a little bit but we would encourage you check out the online store stay home stay safe let's all overreact at least that's how it feels so that this thing doesn't become something that we actually have to need to declare martial law and compromise our food supply and the whole bit. So uh, there you have it. Exciting new things are happening at Getaway Farm. It was a great opportunity to get motivated and get this done because we know that you need food and we also know that we want you to be safe. So that is today's update. That is February, no wait, March Friday, 20th. March 20th. It's not February yes. anymore. We'll get it right one of these well, days. Yeah, we'll see if we get it right tomorrow. So, uh, what we're hoping to do, guys, is put up a video. We're going to try and do daily updates for you just to give you a sense of kind of what's happening up here, what's happening in the shops, any new updates about the COVID stuff. Uh, additionally, if you go to our uh, social media pages, you'll see something pinned there. We'll keep that updated with you know, changes to hours, any changes to operations as it comes. So stay tuned, we'll keep you posted. We will see you tomorrow. Go check out the store.